many people got up this morning and went to work with the intention of getting hurt? The answer, of course, is no one. Hello, I'm Brad Livingston. I am a motivational safety speaker from Elkhart, Kansas, and I was involved in an incident at work that didn't have to happen. As a result of that incident, I was unconscious for two and a half months. Spent four months in a burn intensive care unit, spent 10 months in a rehab center learning to walk again, trying to get the use of my hands, spent 13 more months in therapy at home, and finally, more than two years after the incident, I was ready to go back to work. I make my presentation as a result of an incident that I was involved in at work that never had to happen. But because of complacency, taking a shortcut, improper perspectives, it happened. When I'm making my presentation, I make it in a way that requires the audience to address something they don't want to. And that is how are other people gonna be affected if they get hurt? I talk about the ripple effect. The ripple effect exists and we know it exists, but we don't like to think about that because we don't wanna to have to change the way we work. We wanna get our job done, we wanna make impressions, and we don't wanna take the time always to do it right and to follow all the procedures we know we're supposed to follow. And I make people aware of what's gonna happen, what they may have to live with if they get hurt, what their family has gone through, their coworkers and their friends. And I talk about having the right perspective. And I don't just tell people, you need to have the right perspective at work. I help them understand how to have that proper perspective because our perspective controls our attitude about everything in our lives. And with the right perspective, even work can and should be enjoyed. So I make my presentation not just to prevent people from getting hurt, but to have a happier life and enjoy it. It doesn't matter what kind of company you have, you will have to deal with shortcuts, complacency, bad attitudes. I address all those issues in my one hour presentation. I want people to enjoy life, enjoy work, and go home safe every day because I don't believe that the incidents ever have to happen. Thank you, I look forward to visiting with you and hopefully meeting you face to face and making my presentation for you so that your company can have a better safety record or a stronger safety record if you're already doing it right. <music>